Massachusetts continues to battle the deadly opioid addiction crisis. 22 News State House reporter Alicia Machado is live in Boston with how the state plans to prevent substance abuse deaths. Lawmakers are considering a bill that would create supervised injection sites where people can use drugs under medical supervision. 978 people died from opioid-related deaths in the first half of 2017, according to the Department of Public Health. Lawmakers continue to search for new ways to combat the deadly opioid addiction crisis. It's the presence of fentanyl that has really driven up our overdose rates in Massachusetts. A lot of people are using these drugs and dying. One proposed strategy is to implement what one bill refers to as a safer drug consumption program. Belmont State Senator William Brownsberger filed the bill that would provide a space for people to use pre-obtained drugs under the supervision of health care professionals. The facilities could also provide needle exchanges, overdose prevention services and referrals to treatment. Opponents of the bill question if the program would save people, but rather keep them addicted to dangerous drugs. But if people on fentanyl might be shooting up six, eight times a day, every time they do that, they're taking the risk of death. And um, so I don't think we're talking about people who are thinking too straight. I think we need to find ways to save their lives. The bill is currently under review by the state's Committee on Mental Health, Substance Use and Recovery. Live at the State House in Boston, Alicia Machado for 22 News.